Hey, how's it going? Today I'll show you how to get and set up OTT Navigator to your Fire Stick or Android TV device. And first of all, you have to get the app called Downloader to your Fire Stick. You can actually get Downloader free of charge from your official Amazon App Store. To do so, you just go to search and start typing Downloader in your search bar. And usually, there is even no need to enter the whole name of the app because, as you can see, Downloader has already popped out for us at the bottom. Let's click on Downloader. And now here's the app that you gotta get to your Fire TV Stick. But after you got Downloader, it is not over yet, because you still have to set it up. So now, in order to set up Downloader on your Fire Stick, what we have to do is go to Settings. So let's do it right now. Click on that button with a gear icon. After that, you will scroll down until you find my Fire TV. Open it. And now in here, what you have to do is turn on developer options on your Fire Stick. But on some Fire Sticks, and especially on the new Fire TV Stick devices, the developer options might be hidden by default. So if that's the case, and you cannot find developer options anywhere, then no need to worry because it's pretty easy to move up here. You just have to go to About, select Fire TV Stick, and now you gotta start clicking on the middle button on your remote and do it fast. So let's do it. And as you can see, now for me at the bottom, it says no need, you are already a developer. That's in my case. And in your case, it is going to say that you have become a developer now. So if you go back a bit, you will finally see developer options, which now have pop out for us right here. Open them. Make sure to turn on ADB debugging, then go to install on apps. And from here, all you have to do is locate downloader and turn this option on. So what it does, it's going to allow you to install other applications from the internet and not necessarily only those apps, which are only available in your official Amazon app store by default. And that's exactly what we're going to do right now. So now, finally, we have to go to the list of apps on your Fire TV Stick. There it is, so we open it. And now the, here is the downloader, which is set up and ready to use on your Fire TV Stick. But before actually using the downloader, there is one more thing which I always recommend doing. And it is, of course, connecting to a VPN. In my case, I mostly use NordVPN. Because they are super fast, they got a great app for Fire Sticks, Android TVs, phones, laptops, or pretty much any other device you may use. And they are not expensive for such a premium service. In fact, they cost less than a cup of coffee per month, which is great pricing for us, the users. In a VPN app, you just connect to any server. Let's say I will connect to Ukraine right now. And from the moment you connect, all your traffic is going to be totally encrypted. It means that no one can track you or snoop on you online. And that's really important if you want to stay out of trouble. And if you don't have a VPN yet, but you want to try it out, I do have a great offer for you. If you use my link, which will be in a pinned comment below the video or in the description of the video, you'll get three months of NordVPN totally for free, which is an amazing offer. And if you're watching this video on your TV, or on your Fire Stick, then just grab your phone or your computer, open up a web browser and go to topvpnoffer.com. That's my website, which is going to give you the same amazing deal for NordVPN with three months for free. Or just scan the QR code, which you can see on the screen right now with a camera of your phone. It works the same way and it's also going to give you the same amazing deal. And now, finally, let's use Downloader safely. So you just have to open up Downloader and then wait a bit until it loads for you. After that, on the left side menu, click on Home. And now, lastly, open that search bar. And in here, we need to enter a code, which will be 92483. So once again, it's 92483. That is the code we'll have to enter. Then you just click on Go. And while it's loading, make sure to subscribe my channel, so you will get even more content about Fire Sticks. And now a website has popped out for us, 
and now what we have to do is basically click on ott navigator right here and now the download of the app will start usually it does not take long but of course it all depends on your connection speed as you can see it took us only a couple of seconds to actually download that app then you have to click install and just wait for the app to finish installing on your fire tv stick after that do not click on open yet instead you should press on done because this way you get an option to delete the installation files as you don't really need them anymore on your fire tv stick device so click on delete and then delete once again this way you get rid of unnecessary files from your fire stick and save yourself some free space on your device and that's really important because by default your fire stick doesn't really have too much of free space available anyway and now finally let's go to the list of apps on your device here it is we opened up and now there is the ODD player so first of all i would recommend you to click on the options button on your remote that is the button with three horizontal lines click on it and then press on move to front this way the app will always be at the very top of your application list and therefore it's going to be pretty easy for you to access the app every time you need it just don't forget to keep your european connected to stay safe and out of trouble online then feel free to open ott navigator application and from here it's actually pretty easy to set up so in the app you just have to click on provider and then click on playlist and in here you would be able to enter the m3u link which was given to you by your live tv or iptv provider after that just click on apply and your live tv playlist is going to appear in the app alternatively instead of m3 links you can also use Axiom codes mac portal or stalker portal so let's say your live tv provider gave you an extreme code instead of m3 link in that case you click on extreme codes and then enter the link right here which was also given to you by your live tv provider and also enter a login and a password which were given to you upon getting the iptv service so that's how you get ott navigator to your fire stick as well as how to set up this app enjoy and see you next time bye bye